Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Kayla, and if you're interested in lifestyle videos sprinkled with magic, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I am so excited for today's video because I think it's been a while since we've done a sit down video, and also it's the first sit down video in the new setup. So I'm so excited, and let me know what you guys think of the setup. I'm still not sure where I'm just going to be filming sit down videos yet, but I figured I would just sit here because before I used to sit in front of my closet and like in front of the window, I feel like it's the best lighting. So let me know what you guys think. But anyways, as you guys can tell by the title of today's video, we are going to be doing a collective Disney haul. And this is long overdue because I've been collecting these items like over the past few months and it's time to finally show you guys and I'm so excited because there's so many fun things in here. And also I'm finally going to show you guys what I got from Disneyland because it's actually been a month since I came back from Disneyland and I still just kept everything in the bag. Anyways, let's just let's just get started. But the first so. few things that I'm going to share with you guys is an order from Shop Disney. So the first thing is really, really random, but I saw that they had these Star Wars pajamas on Shop Disney and I just thought they were so cute, okay? Like it has the stormtroopers on there it has chewy it has boba fett it has luke it has leia it has r2d2 i just really like the pattern and i don't know why but these type of like pajamas from shop disney are always so comfortable like i literally look like a child in these but these are just so comfortable and i love wearing them i've been wearing these now that it's been colder here in the bay area and they're just so soft and cozy and comfortable and i love them so i'm really excited about this purchase and i just think that the print is so 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 cute and yeah I love them the next item I'm going to share with you guys also on the Star Wars train is these chewy ears I've wanted these for the longest time and they came back on shop Disney so I figured I would just bite the bullet and just pay for them because these are just so stinking cute okay like they have these like ferny ears and then the little kind of like suede material bow and i just really like them because i feel like they're pretty neutral but like if you're a star wars girl you know that they're chewy so i think these are really really cute so i'm excited to wear these to the park so the next few items that i'm going to share with you guys are also from shop disney but it's more of a recent order that i made and also i don't know if you guys can see but tyco's over here but anyways this collection that came out on shop disney i feel like it's just like perfection when i saw this collection come out at the parks i was obsessed like i think this collection first came out at disney world and then it came out on shop disney and then it came out at disneyland i just knew when i saw it released at walt disney world and i saw all the items i just like knew i had to basically buy the whole entire collection which is like what i did but i'm just so obsessed because it's just so cute you'll see but it is the homestead collection so the first item that i got from this collection are these cute little crocs and they're winter crocs and they just have mickey and minnie on them actually and they are ice skating and I just love how cute it is like I think it's the prettiest shade of blue and then also it's really cozy for the winter time because it has like this Sherpa lining and I don't know I just thought this print was really really cute and I like how it's not Christmas specific but it's more winter so you could wear it like in November December and January and February too because it's like still the winter season so I'm really really excited about these and also my dad actually technically bought these for me because he wanted to buy me these like Shrek Crocs I don't know if you guys have seen those but I love Shrek like Shrek is one of my favorite movies I think those movies are so hilarious but like I wouldn't actually wear these on my feet so I was like you know what you can just buy these for me instead so shout out to you dad i'm really really excited about these crocs and i just think these are so cute and again like i still have the tag on them because i was waiting for this video before wearing them so now i can finally wear them the next item from the homestead collection is this tote bag oh i like this side because it has Minnie mouse on it but it's basically just Minnie mouse playing in the snow making a little snow angel and i just think this bag is so cute and on the back it has chippendale like sliding from like a snow pile or whatever I don't know but I just thought this pattern was really really pretty and also too I like how the bag I feel like is trendy because I feel like this kind of like puffy material has been really really in so I'm just really really excited for this bag and like I use tote bags all the time so I feel like this is just really practical and also just really fun and also because it's this like nylon material I think it'll be really easy to clean this is just like such a fun and exciting purchase and I can't wait to use this just like all of the winter time like how cute does Minnie look? I'm obsessed, okay? I needed her. And the last... Oh, hi, Tyco. Hi, okay. 
And the last item that I got from the Homestead collection is this quarter zip. And I actually did a little unboxing for these Homestead items on my TikTok. And you guys went crazy over this quarter zip. So I'll try to keep an eye out and see when this comes back on Shop Disney. But I just love how minimal Disney it is, you guys. And it's just like the prettiest shade of green. I think this is like sage green. It's just, it's just so pretty. But I just love how minimal Disney it is. And then it just has like all of these characters placed throughout the the quarter zip so it has like mickey here if you guys can see and then there's pluto and then i think there's donald over here and then there's goofy over here so i just think this is so precious and again i'm just like obsessed with the homestead collection and i already wore this and it's so comfy and so cozy and just so perfect for like sweater weather and the only thing though i wish it had pockets like in the front but i guess quarter zips like wouldn't really have pockets but either way i'm just so excited about this purchase i love minimal disney and i love this color i don't really have anything in this color so i'm obsessed as you guys can tell i'm just really into this collection like i think they came out with a thermal of this and I want to get that too. The next few items that I wanted to share with you guys are kind of just like all over the place but the first item is a Halloween item. This cutie little bobble bar keychain and I purchased this I think like in the end of September but I didn't get it until after my trip so I didn't get a chance to use it just because I honestly didn't really do any spooky things after I came back from Disneyland. So it really has just been a little display, kind of like in my Halloween display, but she's so cute. I really wanted to pick her up because they've been killing it with like the bubble bar keychains. And if you guys saw my Disney keychain video, you guys know I'm obsessed with these bubble bar keychains. So I just thought this one was so cute and I just, I just needed to pick her up, okay? So it's just this adorable little Minnie Mouse and she's dressed up as a pumpkin. And I just love the crystal details on the bow, the shoes, and like, I love the pearl details on her little hands. So I'm just obsessed with this little Minnie Mouse and I'm definitely going to use her next Halloween season. I just I just really didn't do anything spooky outside of going to the parks and it came after the parks. So I just love her though and I wanted to share her with you guys because she's so cute. And I saw all the Christmas keychains that came out and those are so adorable as well. So I might have to pick up a Christmas one. I love her and I just think Bobble Bar does such an amazing job with these cute little keychains. And it's just such a great way to add a little touch of Disney to your everyday wardrobe. So love her. The next item is from a small shop and I think I got this on sale when it was on sale. But this is from Adelaide's Fort and it's basically kind of like this like vintage-y ish or retro tank top a little crop top moment but it just says i love disney and i believe this is from adelaide's fort and it's really really comfortable and again i just love how minimal it is and it's just like a basic t-shirt that i could wear with like anything i actually wore this once i'll insert a picture here and i thought it was really cute but yeah i need to wear this more but it's kind of like not the season anymore to wear tank tops but either way i think it's like it would look cute with this outfit but we love Adelaide's Fort. She always has really cute graphic tees, so had to pick this up. The next item is another fun little crop top from another small shop, and I just knew I had to pick this up. Like, it came out, and then I think I missed the drop. Like, it was all sold out, so I knew when it came out again, I had to get it, and I got it. So I picked up this little crop top from Fantasy Feelings. Oh my gosh. Like, this is so perfect. I'm obsessed with the design. It says, the happiest place on earth, and then it has our little Sleeping Beauty castle, and then it says, in my fantasy feelings, for fantasy feelings, and then on the back it says, opening day, and it just has all of the attractions, I believe, that were open on opening day, so this is so cute, and I... I can't wait to wear this like I'm gonna wear this soon but I think I might wear it on an upcoming trip to the parks that'll be so cute I just love this little crop top and then oh for sizing reference I got this little crop top from fantasy feelings in a size large and then the one from Adelaide's for I believe I also got a large just because they're both crop tops and you know I have big girls so i just want to make sure it fits comfortably and it covers everything so i got a large for both but either way these small shops are killing it like i feel like these two little baby tees are just for that girl disney outfits and i love them okay check out adelaide's four and fantasy feelings the next item that i got is actually from mercari ah okay 
it's from Depop. So the next item is a little vintage t-shirt that I got from Depop. Again, another Star Wars item. I am really just like a Star Wars girly now, but I saw this and I knew I just had to pick it up, okay? Like this is iconic. It basically has Star Wars on there. I think that's the Death Star. And then it has Jedi Mickey Mouse. Like that is so cute, okay? It has Jedi Mickey Mouse. And I believe this is from Star Wars Day maybe. I don't know, but it's a size... It's a size large, but I think this is supposed to be like a kid's t-shirt, but either way it fits, but it's definitely on the snugger side, but it still fits really nicely and I think I could just wear it like cropped or something or just like tucked in to cargos or jeans and it'll be really cute. But I just needed this because it's just so iconic with Jedi Mickey and it looks like Sorcerer Mickey and Sorcerer Mickey is like definitely my favorite Mickey. Yeah, Sorcerer Mickey is my favorite Mickey, so it's kind of like giving that vibe but it's Star Wars so I love this. So the next item I'm going to share with you guys is from H&M and this haul is all over the place because I have some Halloween items and I also have some like winter Christmas items but you know oh well but I got this Mickey Mouse crew neck and I just think it's so cute I'm just like really I'm, I'm clearly just really into all of these like winter Disney pieces because again it's not holiday specific and I could wear it past Christmas so it says greetings oh wait no it says Snowtown Mickey Mouse and then he's skiing and then it says let's winter and I don't know why I just like have a thing for whenever I see the Disney characters like skiing or snowboarding because I ski and I snowboard and I just feel like that's so cool and it also kind of like reminds me of my parents so either way I had to pick this up and I also kind of love how it gives like a retro like vintagey vibe so H&M definitely has like a lot of really cute crew necks and stuff and I just I just knew I had to pick this up and I picked it up in a large and again wait no I picked it up in a medium because this is actually supposed to be already an oversized fit so I got a medium that's like my normal size and it's still definitely oversized but I think I might wear it on an upcoming trip to the parks and I think it'll look really cute with like my snowman Mickey lounge fly but I just I also really love the colors too because it's like blue and white so overall this is just like such a perfect find and I highly recommend you guys pick it up because just so adorable okay and the last few items I'm going to share with you guys are from my recent trip to the parks and I'm so excited to finally share this with you guys because it's just been sitting in this bag since I got home and it's been like, it's been like a month so we need to open this, okay? The first item that I got is, this is like shopping all over again or just like getting new presents because I haven't seen it in so long, but the first item that I got is this little Disneyland tennis skirt and again, I love it because it's minimal Disney so it's just black and then it has a little Minnie Mouse here on the side and then it has the castle in the back and I can't wait to wear this to play tennis with and what I love about this skirt is it actually has shorts under so this actually will be really really perfect to play tennis in and I got this in a size small because I figured it was just like a little stretchy but it's just so cute and so minimal and I feel like you could also wear it like normally like you don't have to play tennis but you could pair it with like a cute little white tank top or something and like a denim jacket and I feel like that'll be really perfect but again this is kind of like more of a spring and summer thing so spring and summer I'm gonna be wearing this all the time okay but I just feel like this was such a perfect find and I saw this on my Instagram before I went on my trip so I knew if I found it I definitely wanted to pick it up and luckily I found it because I think I only saw this at Disneyland I don't know if I really saw it like in World of Disney or in Disney California Adventure so I feel really Really, really lucky that I found this little skirt. The next item that I got is a fun little piece of jewelry and it's this little Mickey necklace and what I really really like about it is it has this extra little key link detailing I think it is so it's not just like a regular gold chain so it kind of just adds some dimension to your stack and then it just has this little crystallized Mickey and I just think it's really really pretty and again you guys know me I'm all about my gold jewelry so it would look really cute with like this set here or just like all the other gold jewelry that I have but I just thought this was a really cute kind of like edgy Disney jewelry find so definitely pick this up if you guys see it at the parks because I just think it's so cute the next few items are the pins I got and I believe I think I already showed you in the vlogs but I'm gonna, I'm gonna show it in this video anyways but first it's this little Star Wars pin and it has Darth Vader walking I forgot what these are called hello 
Yes. What were what was this called? AT AT. Oh, okay, thank you. So it's Darth Vader walking these little AT-ATs and I just thought that was so funny because it's like he's walking a dog and obviously like I have Tyco so I just knew I had to pick this up. I saw someone post it on their stories so I was definitely on the hunt for this pin and I found it in the little pin booth at Downtown Disney. The next two pins I got were from Oogie Boogie. One is the Magic Key Holder pin and one is the Special Event pin so it was my first Oogie Boogie, you guys, so I had to pick these up. This one is, like, all silver or metal finish, I guess, and it has all the villains on there, and then this one has the man himself, Oogie Boogie, and he's holding a bunch of dice, and I just thought these were so fun. I know I had to pick these up because I wasn't really into any of the other Oogie Boogie merch that they had because it's all, like, lime green and black, and, like, that's not really my vibe, so I knew if they had pins, I would pick them up because it's just a fun little way to commemorate me going to my first oogie boogie so this was a fun purchase and i'm really happy about these and also i feel like i don't really have like a lot of villain pins so gotta diversify my pin collection <laughs> and the last item that i'm going to share with you guys is another commemorative item because we stayed at the disneyland hotel on my last trip and of course i needed something to commemorate the trip with so i was on the hunt for pins but i couldn't find anything but i did find this adorable crew neck and I feel like it's kind of different than my other crew necks because it's not the typical crew neck shape I feel like like usually it has like a pretty high neckline and then it has like a cinched waist here but it's kind of just more of like a t-shirt fit or like a long sleeve t-shirt fit but a sweater so that's really nice it feels really soft and cozy so I'm really excited to actually wear it but it basically just has the Disneyland Hotel logo on there and then it has little resort Minnie Mouse here and again I just think this was such a perfect way to commemorate the trip because it's just so soft and and cozy and whenever I wear it I'll just think of my magical stay at the Disneyland Hotel and I love her I'm so excited to finally wear it I think they didn't really have a lot of Disneyland Hotel exclusive merch there so I'm glad I could actually find something I like and pick it up and I got this in a size extra large because again I think this is a women's fit so it was a little bit tighter and again I wanted something a little more oversized so I got an extra large and that pretty much wraps up my huge Disney haul I know there was a lot but I promise you guys I did not just buy this all at once this was over the course of like a few months but there were so many fun goodies in here. I'm so excited that I was finally able to share them with you guys. So definitely check out some of the small shops that I mentioned and check out some of the other pieces that I got like on Shop Disney or like at H&M. There was a lot of good things in here, okay? Like this was a really good haul. So I hope you guys enjoyed. But, but anyways, I'm going to wrap up this video here. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys liked it. If you liked it, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Let me know down below in the comments what was your favorite item from the haul. My personal favorite right now, just because I've been wearing it every night, are these little star wars pajamas i just think that they're so cozy and they're so warm because like my room is freezing but these are a really good purchase be sure to hit that subscribe button so you never miss a video from me let's stay connected follow me on my socials they're both as kayla's ever after and thank you guys so much for watching i love you so much and i'll see you in the next one bye